Hello there guys, this is Nerf Stranger X. God damn it, hasn't it been a long time? Jesus Christ, I'm so sorry, but here I am with my reaction to episode 14 of season 7. I honestly didn't expect it. It's Sunday today and I just now saw my friend Kativo upload his reaction to the episode. I was like, a new episode is already out? God damn it, I wasn't prepared for anything. So, well anyways, here is my reaction. So first off, before I start this video, I wanna uh, uh, mention a few things. So, I know you guys are still waiting for my OC video. It's it's still in the production. I'm still writing on the script. A few things are already done. It's, it's taking a long time and uh, yeah. Another thing is I'm moving very soon. Um, like, I'm leaving my home where I am right now. I've found a new one. I'm opening like, a, like uh, I'm, I'm moving together with, with some friends of mine to live together uh, finally away from my uh, childhood home. <laughs> so I have more space for my stuff. All that will be vlogged and stuff and that will be fantastic. And I'm so excited, it's only three weeks away since, uh, since when I'm moving. Um, so I have a lot to do. Um, besides that, uh, my room is finally cleaned up. You know, I already had a mess. Uh, I always had a messy room when I recorded my videos. I'm really sorry for that, but that's changing now since I'm gonna move. And the room is clean, so very soon a room tour will follow, so you can finally see all the extent of merchandise that I have, the setup I have, the setup I have, blah blah blah, all that stuff I want to show to you guys in a video and that's what I'm gonna do and as for my uh, moving uh, I'm gonna make a video with a lot of my merchandise that I'm gonna sell and trade and whatnot uh, because I, of course for the uh, moving I need some money at least and I wanna sell some of my pony merchandise and that will all be done in a, another video so you will have still to wait for that I'm very sorry but yeah I'm busy right now okay and yeah uh, Galacon was, <clears throat> and yeah, uh, um, hmm. before I start the reaction, I need to do one thing to kind of imitate uh, Apple Geek. Wait a second. I'm just too proud to not show it in a video. <laughs> I have one too now. Daybreaker plushie, isn't she fantastic? <gasps> uh, okay, yeah, I'm gonna sit her down right here. We all can see her, I guess. Yes, or not, yes. <laughs> okay, uh, but yeah, let's start this reaction. Fame and Misfortune, episode 14 of season seven. All right, I know nothing about this episode, just like always, I'm unspoiled. It's Fame and Misfortune, and let's start. Three, two, one, and Twilight. Okay, oh, there was a lag, another lag. Sorry, Princess Twilight. <clears throat> that was meant for her. Okay, ice, ice war. Haha! <laughs> I wouldn't mind that either. Coconut cream, what are you doing? What? That was meant for my ex friend. I'm not your ex friend. You're my ex friend. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Hmm. What, so you see, ever was a... isn't always easy, but there's no doubt it's worth fighting for. Well, that's <laughs> what they did, kind of. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Oh, adorable. So we have a Twilight episode. That's nice. No. Uh, I love Twilight. I've, I've set my Twilight up here as well. Said Discord and Daybreaker. Starlight. Uh -huh. Here it is. Lot. What is that? Come on, Starlight. Don't judge a book by its cover. <gasps> this is the friendship journal my friends and I used to keep. It's filled with all the Oh, that's cool. Life. Continuity. Easy, Jesus. But there's no doubt it's worth fighting for. Oh. Oh, Jesus. You have to rewrite I'll that. Judge a book by its cover just this once. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that lip animation. Awesome. Holy shit, it's been such a relatively long time since I watched an episode. I mean, episode 13 is like two months old now. Um, yeah, whatever. Okay, I'm excited about this. Starlight and Twilight, always always my favorite episodes with those. 
not really favorite favorite episodes, but those are some of my favorite characters. So yes, yes, yes. Let's see, let's see. All right, all right. <clears throat> Who did this piece of art? Thanks for coming, Devin Cody. I've got a surprise for you. What is it, Twilight? Do I need to prepare myself? It's this. Oh, she rewrote it. No, it's Why still so little sweaty? one. Okay. Wait a minute. <gasps> is this our old friendship journal? I haven't seen this in a while. Oh, that's so cool. It's so cool. Ooh, I like it. Wait, it's looking a little uh, overripe. I'll say. There's a smushed apple in Applejack's lessons. <laughs> Fluttershy's lessons are so small. <laughs> they barely breathe. <laughs> Why? Yeah. Wanted to leave room for all of you. Oh, God. Adorable. <laughs> I don't even know what this is. It's. It is called calligraphy, darling. If you're going to make words, at least make them fabulous. Well, of course. What did you expect? Okay. Looks like you got a little aggressive with your friendship lessons, Rainbow Dash. What can I say? When I learn something, I learn it hard. Yes, of course. That's. I found mm -hmm. Pinky's page. <laughs> well, I am surprised. That wasn't. This the book is surprise. breaking all the laws of physics, and no one cares. It's gonna re re pre re repair itself. We'll make copies for everyone. Ta -da. That's so awesome. Decided to make one for each of you. That's amazing. A perfect copy. I learned the spell years ago when I needed to make copies of a certain <clears throat> manifesto. Ah! <laughs> 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 that perfect copy. Okay. Oh, I'd forgotten all about this lesson. <laughs> Remember this one? For when I this episode is continuity. Wow. Always got your back. Aw, cheese sandwich. <laughs> After Twilight remembered the journal, mm. I had so much mm. fun all the stuff you've all learned. That's awesome. Holy shit. Copy. And that brings me to the second part of the surprise. My idea. How would you girls feel about making our journal available for every pony? If we can get these lessons into other ponies' hooves, maybe they'll okay. get from them. That's an interesting that's idea. That's a great idea. Isn't there a lot of private stuff in there, too? We I mean... Did we wanted to. Sounds fabulous. <laughs> I'm awesome. Oh yeah, uh, good idea. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that's cool. I like it. That that's a cool idea. So they're even more fame now since they're part of books. Oh, okay. Wow. No, I don't want to play with you anymore. Why not? You love playing hopscotch. No, you do because you always win. Hey, girls, couldn't help it over here. You might I like the green one. Either. Maybe That's read cool, Rainbow cool Dash's way. chapter on Rainbow Falls. It might help. Sure, princess. Thanks, Twilight. But reading something isn't always oh, making her, you know, of your own. Cutie Mark summer camp. Now every pony's definitely gonna sign up for it. This is gonna be awesome. <laughs> a Cutie Mark camp is a great idea. Yeah, but the purpose of the journal isn't supposed to be marketing. Well, what did you expect? You I basically just hope did those that. actually learn something from our lessons. They will. I'm sure ponies all across Equestria will. Whoa! Can we get a autograph? Uh, hello. Can I help you? We're here all the way from Philadelphia because we got copies of your friendship journal. Wow, how wonderful. What was your favorite friendship? Will you sign them? Oh, uh, I guess so. So, what did you think of the lessons? Oh, we haven't read them. These are keepsakes. We gotta keep them in mint condition. Well, of course. That's what you gotta do with fame people like... Princess wow, Twilight and the. Trip. 
<laughs> Typical bronies and, and geeks and uh, nerds like traveling long ways just for simple stuff. <laughs> awesome. I agree. You spy! I didn't know her there. I only wish they'd left Rarity out. She clearly doesn't belong in that book with the rest of them. Oh, I know. Who does she think she is? Certainly she did a fine job setting up the Ponyville Day oh, celebration. She's but hearing she it. Really believe it was a success just because of her? <laughs> the nerve. Ooh. Ow. Ouch. That's not what Ouch. she was saying. Ow. Rarity. Well, I said it's a lot of private stuff in there too. And that doesn't belong to anyone. Uh, to all, everyone. The mean things those ponies were saying. Yeah, well, be devastated. Mm, you didn't put her. enough thought into this, I'm I guess. Chat with these two. Well, it's just their personal opinion in the end. I mean, Rarity, it's like with your favorite character. I don't like every musical artist. Pinky, I've got to. Ponies keep stopping by to tell me my entries are hilarious. Haha. <laughs> So glad to hear some ponies are being inspired by the journal. Hey, look! There's Pinkie Pie, the funny one. <laughs> the funny one. They're getting titles now. Okay. I mean, weren't they famous before as the element barriers? I'm afraid this whole journal thing really upset her. Huh? That's too bad. Wait, that wasn't even funny. Oh god. Okay, well, I guess, uh, but those ponies are just like they know them privately. <laughs> wow. Yep. Thank you, Lily. <laughs> but how are they gonna get out of that? Oh, Sessa Flesh. Exactly! Exactly! Oh god. I mean, it's pretty similar to real life. Image that one of your old I classmates. All the Sparkle lessons because they were getting in the way of the good ones. What do you mean you skipped the lessons? We've all had valuable experiences. Hey, here's a great idea. Now, it's wow, it's so interesting to, to see season. like how Nothing some authors well, are probably getting their critique. Because oh, hear her bowling lessons. Come on, tell us again about when it's a fucking you princess of friendship standing right behind them, and they're just saying again? that. We already covered that one. Wow, the nerve. Jesus. <laughs> Come on, you don't want to disappoint your fans. It's just that I uh, really need to get those storm clouds back in their pens. Oh, cool. We'll come along. You can tell us the story. Oh, all these yeah! Pegasi. Sweet. Oh, poor Twiley. It's adorable. Oh. Uh, who's missing Applejack? Oh shit! Just leave me alone. Am I right? Fluttershy, what's wrong? We want answers. Yeah, we're entitled to know. What is it, Every Pony? We want to know why Fluttershy keeps learning the same thing over and over again. Be assertive already. Even I've learned more than she has. Why can't I be in the book? What? Really? Are you attacking my friend because you want to be in a book? It's okay. I got this girl. This episode is meant up, for the bronies listening. that are criticizing the episode writers. Get there, but can you <clears throat> say that you can learn something one time and completely change who you are? I didn't think so. Wow. That's so You're cool how they defend themselves. I mean, not the characters, but the. I don't know how I feel about that. Episode writers. Mm. That's so interesting. <laughs> or at least it kind of feels like that. It feels on, a, like on some level, it's cool. The friendship part of the friendship journals. As I said, she didn't put enough thought into it. Rarity, are you all right? <laughs> well, of course she isn't. It's, it's what Rarity. What are you doing? Well, a gown, darling. I was just expecting a creepy what? face. <laughs> you know, I'm stress sewing. <laughs> <laughs> stress sewing? When I overheard those two at the cafe, I suddenly understood why I've been oh getting cancellations for days. Oh my goodness! Look at her mate. What? Why? You know, you know, already isn't well worse. when her main and because well, like that. Me They're me. <sighs> 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 
What? I'm sure if I go out there and talk Come on, that's a bit extreme, it isn't it? Reasonable. I need a hundred blankets and I need them now. Sorry, Twilight. Get <laughs> away, pony who still likes me. I don't need nothing fancy. What's the matter, Applejack? I'm popular, Twilight. I'm popular and I don't like it one bit. So some of them are popular and some of them are not. It's interesting. I mean, Rarity has a huge fan base, doesn't she? I mean, like in real life with the bronies and stuff. That is not how it should work. Apple Geek will feel related. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Sorry, bro. Shout out to you. Jack, who are all these ponies? They call themselves the Sweet Apple Admirers. They say they read my journal entries and they felt like a part of the family. And now they actually want to become part of the family. Well, that's not how it works. Your journal entries? Yeah, you know, all the stuff about how friends are like family and whatnot. Can't you get rid uh, of Ah, yes. Them? Kick out my own family? Recording. Granny Smith, hang on! We'd never release that journal. What is that? <laughs> Need to scooch up a bit here. There you are. Okay. okay. I just left Rarity. I think she's doing better. And <clears throat> oh boy, window staring, huh? <laughs> Isn't that bad at Sweet Apple Acres. It's bad everywhere. I thought I was doing something good. I thought I was helping. <laughs> <laughs> the anti-Rarity so balloons. Much. Jesus anti Christ. Anti. Oh, Twilight, <laughs> it's not your fault. <laughs> Of course it's my fault. Oh, if I the had picture. Not the big idea to make copies. None of this would be happening. I'm afraid I made life awful for my friends. I really think you're being too hard on yourself. Am I? Ooh. <laughs> yeah, well. <laughs> I didn't know where else to go. I've got so much cooking and cleaning and family in to do. I ain't got time for anything else. These ponies aren't laughing every time you talk. Not even I want to be funny all the time. I'm telling you. Oh, Flush is so pissed. You think you've got problems? I know I'm awesome, but I can't even go to the bathroom without some pony trying to tell me how cool I am. <laughs> uh, Rarity? What are you wearing? Okay. My emotions done and stress couture. I don't know what Emotion you're dress. Doing, but I have to defend myself one more time. Oh, she is so pissed. Look at that. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> okay, so maybe It's almost as, as if Discord has a, had his fingers wrong. in there, but yes, I did. it isn't. Interesting. My idea. And it backfired <clears throat> in ways I could never have imagined. It's not your fault. It's every pony else's. They're just focusing on the wrong things and <gasps> wait here. I've got an idea. I can't wait any longer. I've got to fix this. Now I'm curious. Starlight's gonna save the day, isn't isn't she? Use your spell. Candlelight Chronicle. Quick question. What would you say to ponies who wonder why you moved to Ponyville in the first place? I moved here to learn about friendship. That's why the journal even exists. It took some time for me okay. to get the hang of it. But it was each of these ponies standing next to me who taught me the lessons in those journals. Applejack, Pinkie Pie, Rainbow Dash, Rarity, and Fluttershy too. Then it was all of you. I've learned so much from... What I mean is, some ponies would argue that it doesn't seem believable that the six of you would be friends. Believable? Well, sure. I read this journal cover to cover, and I have to say, your character would have been much more interesting if she'd stayed in Canterlot. My character? We are real Wow, friends. holy this shit! This journal is a record of things that actually happened to us. We made mistakes, and we learned from them. What about Rarity? Are we really supposed to believe she learned anything she wrote in there? That's why you want to be Team Dash! She's the only 
one who didn't really need to learn anything because she wow. was already <laughs> Yes, that's what Rainbow thinks, probably. <laughs> Fluttershy is just so painfully shy, it's hard to wait. I mean, come on! Oh, yeah. <laughs> the haters! Jesus Christ! Oh my god, it's so relatable. <laughs> Oh, a song! Me and Pen. None of us claim to be perfect, and it's sad if that's what you all think. Our flaws help to make us special. They bond us and keep us strong. Our flaws are what brought us together. So stop acting like something's wrong. We're not flawless. We're a work in progress. We got dents and we got quirks, but it's our flaws that make us work. I've met Kazumi Evans, her singer voice, just a couple of weeks ago. <clears throat> oh. Aww. It took me a while to be confident to really come out of my shell. But no pony has to be perfect. By now, don't you know us so well? Because, yeah, we're not flawless. We're a work in progress. We got dance and we got quirks. But it's a good song. Jesus. Aww. Awesome. That, but no one cares. So you see, every pony, none of us ever claimed to be perfect. Without our flaws, there wouldn't be any friendship lessons to learn. Without our flaws, there probably wouldn't be any friendships at all. Aww. Everyone got their fans and their haters. Jesus Christ. Holy shit. It's how they. Handle that topic is so interesting. Ponies who have something I think you should hear. Um, huh. we just wanted to say thank you to all of you. Yeah, our friendship. Well, we were having trouble until we read your journal. It showed us that friends can go through all sorts of tough times and come through stronger than before. It's made us better friends than we've ever been. Really? Mm-hmm. Oh. Oh, I can't tell you how much it means to hear that. Thank you for telling us. We've had a tough couple of days, but knowing we've helped fillies like you... It makes everything we've been through worth it. Absolutely. Fads come and go. Friendship is forever. There are worse things than not being able to do anything without being told I'm awesome. And we can't <gasps> change the way other ponies think about us, but we can change how we let it affect us. Or how we don't let it affect us. <laughs> Go ahead. Laugh. So, and uh, what what you gonna do now with everyone else? <laughs> Reckon we still have to deal with them, don't we? Exactly. <laughs> Stay in the friendship moment, Applejack. They can wait a little longer. You're just gonna leave it there? What? Damn cliffhanger though. Whoa, okay. <clears throat> All right, so this was episode 14, Fame as and Misfortune. So what is there to say? It's 
it's a very very interesting concept and I'm not entirely sure how they meant this episode like did they actually mean to tell the fans that hate and too much fan fangasm is is, is, too, is, is just enough you know um, it's complicated but it's very interesting how they put that episode it just felt like they're talking directly to us fans to some haters of for example rainbow dash or, or fluttershy and stuff like so many fans like um <laughs> so many fans uh, um disapprove of fluttershy because she at least seems to not uh evolve as much as the others to some point she's still somewhat shy and stuff like that but that's fine that's okay uh, but there are many people who think that she is just isn't changing enough that her character development isn't enough that their character isn't enough or not perfect enough and that's exactly what these ponies said they they kind of released their journal and that made them seem like only a book character so their fans kind of saw them as just that and uh, criticized them on that level too so yeah what is there to say a very very interesting concept very very interesting episode I think it is presented very well uh, it's very interesting I just can't really handle the fact that they didn't uh, conclude this I mean if there is gonna be con continuity and they're gonna talk about this topic in the next episode too but they just can't leave it at that point I mean that was a massacre you could say of fans and hate uh, outside there and they're just gonna leave it at that <laughs> I want to at least know how they solve this problem that everyone is gonna be fine with them again and not see them as fame people just as uh, another citizen of the city because that's what they want to be I mean it's very interesting how respectless some ponies can be uh, in front of Twilight since she's a princess I wouldn't dare to speak like some of those did in front of a princess so uh, you know what I mean? I mean, all of them are heroes heroes, and kind of fam famous for everything they did. Um, they're the element barriers, defeated many, many villains and blah, 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 saved Equestria countless times and they will save it countless times again, probably. So, uh, yeah, it's, it's not... It's, it's, in, it's complicated to, to kind of feel into this. But it's still very interesting. It was an interesting episode to watch. Um, yeah, the big mistake was here by Twilight not putting much thought into the uh, like release of this book. But uh, yeah, as I said, very interesting. Um, yeah, good episode. I liked it. Kind of since it was so so different from everything we've seen so far, um, I think it deserves some plus points. Uh, yeah, yeah, that that that's it for today's video. Uh, I hope you liked it. As I said, there are more videos coming to certain topics as I talked about in the beginning. Um, and yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Nerf Strangers out. Leave a like if you enjoyed it or not if you didn't. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Subscribe to see more and support me on Patreon. Links all in the description and follow my Instagram. Blah, blah, blah. See you. Bye, guys. <laughs>